Right now at 5, a busy night in Washington. We begin with breaking news out of Northwest D.C. Three people shot, including a girl, right off of Connecticut Avenue in the Van Ness neighborhood. Yes, yeah, so a residents of an apartment building capturing that terrifying sound of gunshots during the active shooter situation near Connecticut Avenue. We got you covered with minute-by-minute -minute updates. All of this happening right by the University of D.C.'s Van Ness campus, which is currently on lockdown. Right now, you are looking at a live video of the scene. And, you know, we came on the air, what, 30, 30 minutes ago uh, with this breaking news. And... Police were going into the scene then. 30 minutes later, they are still going into the scene right now. So here's where we're at. We have three people shot. One of them is a juvenile, a kid. No word, no word on exactly who those folks are, if they're part of the university, if they are part of the Edmund Burke School, which is a middle and a high school in, uh, in, in that area. But again, you're looking at a live video there of the Van Ness neighborhood, an incredibly, incredibly active scene there. And still no official word from police on whether or not a suspect is in custody. What they are asking you to do right now is obviously stay away from all of that as much as you possibly can. Connecticut Avenue is a vital, vital street in D.C., so you're going to have to find a different way to get back home if you're, if you're headed out to Maryland or to the Northern Virginia area. But again, a very active scene in Washington, D.C. right now, and still unclear whether or not the shooter the suspect is in custody. And